The United Kingdom is facing an alarming increase in suicide rates among trans youth, a phenomenon being referred to as an epidemic. The surge is due to limitations on gender-affirming care. A recent tragedy involves Jason Pullman, a 15-year-old. Extended waiting periods for essential care intensify the situation. Many wait years to obtain crucial support. The gravity of the situation cannot be overstated. It is a crisis that demands immediate attention and action. Meanwhile, across the pond, we see a stark contrast in how such matters are being addressed. President Biden, in his first presidential press conference, made it clear that he stands for democracy over autocracy. He criticized efforts to restrict voting access, a sentiment that could very well extend to the broader fight for equality and human rights, including those of the LGBTQ community. However, it's not just political figures who shape the narrative. Cultural icons too play a significant role. The best-selling author J.K. Rowling has faced backlash for her anti-trans comments. Despite a podcast addressing her legacy and personal experiences, Rowling did not directly confront her anti-trans statements. This has sparked further controversy and has been condemned by LGBTQ advocates. These instances underscore the urgency of creating safe, inclusive spaces for all individuals, regardless of their gender identity. They highlight the need for empathy, understanding, and actions that affirm, rather than deny, the rights and identities of trans individuals. In conclusion, the world is at a critical juncture in the fight for LGBTQ rights. The alarming rise in suicide rates among trans youth in the UK is a call to action for all of us. Let's take inspiration from figures like President Biden and learn from the controversy surrounding J.K. Rowling. Our words and actions have the power to shape the lives of others. Let's use them to create a more inclusive world. Thank you for joining us today and remember, every step we take towards understanding and acceptance makes a difference. Until next time, keep questioning, keep learning, and keep pushing for a more inclusive world.